Frank Ware for Dinosaur Rocketry, and um, yesterday at lunch I had a, a fortune cookie that said, um, you'll be inspired to finish a task that you've been putting off, and so here it is, this was my task, so this is the um, Orion shuttle from 2001 A Space Odyssey, um, at least my take on it. Um, the top view and the side view were pretty close modified the bottom part so that it comes down flat so that I can put the rocket runner in line, the thrust profile right in line with the top of the wing so it doesn't want to pitch. And I've done it in a simple uh, box fuselage with gu gusseted corners that I could round off and kind of give the uh, look but keep a real light, easy to make um, shape. Um, it's six millimeter and three millimeter depth run. And uh, black sharpie for panel lines and some trim vinyl accents. On the uh, model, there's no vertical stabilizer, so it isn't stable, of course. So I had to add a tail to it, but um, I painted it flat black so it's not so obvious and um, put some decals in the marking there to kind of look like the hump that's on the uh, on the model. Um, it's 38 inches long, 20 inch wingspan, and weighs uh, just over six ounces, ready to fly. And I'm using a small. 18 millimeter uh, Aerotech uh, rocket glider motor that uh, has a long slow burn, and we're going to give it a flight. Yeah. Taking off. Five, four, three, two, one.